हेलो वेलकम टू एवरी वन इन दिस वीडियो दिस इज आर पार्ट फोर द सोल्यूशन ऑफ सी सी एट दैट इज मैथमेटिकल मेथड थ्री ऑफ द इयर टू थाउजेंड ट्वेंटी थ्री अंडर यूनिवर्सिटी फिजिक्स ऑनर्स लुक एट दि टोटल क्वेश्चन पेपर दू थाउजेंड ट्वेंटी थ्री दिस इज क्वेश्चन नंबर वन हुई डिसकस इन पार्ट वन देन क्वेश्चन नंबर टू एंड थ्री डिसकस इन पार्ट टू देन क्वेश्चन नंबर फोर एंड फाइव डिसकस इन पार्ट थ्री and today we want to discuss question number 6 there is a 3 3 6 question and in upcoming uh, part we will be continue question number 7 so let's start first question say consider two points on xy plane there is two point xy plane express the length of car joining two points and lying in xy plane hence obtain the path of the shortest length using calculus of variation this question also asked in 2022 Uh, just uh, if if you was the previous year solution you can was this one so if you consider this two point its coordinate is x1 y1 this is coordinate x2 y2 and the length ds cos to like that dx square plus dy square small length and if you integrating total you will be get total path length okay here the function is like that the length of car is will be shortest when the this variation will be zero so if you taking the euler lagrangian uh, equation okay there is missing of a one page theek hai just connecting this page uh, i just want to connect this page Yeah, already, already we have uh, done this in the year two thousand twenty-two. Just taking the solution of this paper, and you can see we already discuss this one in earlier video, earlier series solution of the year two thousand twenty-two of this paper. So just check. and put the solution in this there is a blinking actually slow down this one sorry for this incorporated 2022 just see the question that was i think 6a the question number also same this variation of principal cause yes 6a go to the answer of 6a uh, 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 this is 6a yes 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 i just uh, this page okay take the copy of this page and paste here uh, this one here okay control v and also paste in this total solution of this paper Uh, that is six a six a yes 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 at that point okay save this one and continue with this one okay so just <laughs> look at the uh, sorry for this interruption so you can see by Euler Lagrangian equation. dt of del f del y prime minus del f del y is equals to zero. Here you can say this this f is fun only function of uh, y prime y prime. So this uh, del f del y is zero. Since this is zero, del f del y prime uh, and and del f del y prime just taking the derivative you can see here. From here you can find del f del y prime is equals to one by two root under one plus y prime square. Into two y prime, so this is y prime by root under um, root under it. This, if you put this value, this is zero, so this will be zero. So this is the constant. Taking the right hand side and squaring both side, you will be obtain this one. And taking the y prime square as a common, you will be obtain this equation. And this is constant. You can see this c this c are constant. This is the speed of light in free space, which is constant. So this total quantity will be constant. Since y prime is nothing but dy by dx, so y is x plus b. So this represents a equation of straight line. So here we obtain the shortest path will be the straight line. Obtain the path of the shortest that is the straight line. Straight line will be the shortest path between these two points. 
नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन से कंसीडर लैग्रेंजियन एल ऑफ एन एन पार्टिकल सिस्टम सो दैट टोटल मोमेंटम ऑफ दिस सिस्टम विल बी कंजर्व इफ द लैग्रेंजियन रिमेन इनवेरिएंट अंडर द ट्रांसलेशन दैट इज आर आई टू आर आई प्लस डी दैट इज द होमोजिनिटी ऑफ स्पेस वो एट डी इज द आर्बिटरी स्मॉल कॉन्स्टेंट ट्रांसलेशनल वेक्टर सो ड्यू टू चेंज ऑफ दिस कॉर्डिनेट दैट इज आर वेक्टर आर आई वेक्टर टू आर आई प्लस डी वेन यू चेंज दिस पोजिशन दैट इज द arbitrary distance change that is coordinate change then uh, due to this change the change in La lagrangian will be delta l and this will be like that as the lagrangian is invariant so delta l must be zero this is this mean that is equals to zero and you know the lagrangian equation of motion is like that dt of del l del r dot minus del l del r is equals to zero for n particle taking the summation this is for uh, one particle this is for n particle sum taking the summation and you uh, you know uh, you 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 can see as the lagrangian is invariant so this will be zero if you put the value of this part is zero you will be obtain this expression and you know that is del l del r dot is nothing but pi that is a generalized momentum this is the generalized momentum so if you interchange the summation and dd will be obtain uh, is dd is zero that means summation of this one is constant because the uh, derivative of constant is zero hence you can see the summation of pi that is the total linear momentum that is the total linear momentum is conserved under this transformation next that is the hamiltonian is given and canonical equation of this are like that that is qi dot equals to del h del pi and pi dot is equal to minus del h del qi is in the legendary transformation find out lagrangian l is equals to this one so लेजेंडरी ट्रांसफॉर्मेशन यू नो एच इक्वल्स टू समेशन पी आई क्यू आई डॉट माइनस एल सो एल इज इक्वल्स टू लाइक दैट इफ यू टेकिंग दि डेरीवेटिव डी एल इज टेकिंग द डेरीवेटिव ऑफ दिस वन एंड दिस डी एच डी एच कैन बी रिटर्न इन द समेशन फॉर्म एंड फूड दिस वैल्यू डेल एच डेल क्यू आई डेल एच डेल क्यू आई इज माइनस पी आई डॉट एंड डेल एच डेल पी आई इक्वल टू क्यू आई डॉट टेकिंग दिस वन यू विल बी ऑप्टन दिस एक्सप्रेशन एंड L as a function of qi, qi dot and t, so dl is equals to this one in the summation form. There is three function. So if you comparing these two equation, this is equation number one and this is equation number two. You can see there is a coefficient of d qi is pi dot and there is a coefficient of d qi is del i del qi dot del qi. So uh, pi dot equal to del i del qi and in in the coefficient of d qi dot is compare compare here. del l del q i a dot and there is pi uh, pi so this will be obtained pi and pi dot is like that so if you taking the uh, derivative with respect to time here you will be obtain this equation this two are equal so this will be same and if you taking the left side you will be obtain this expression this is nothing but lagrangian equation of motion so generally we find the hamiltonian equation of motion for lagrangian equation of motion is the legend transformation but here the question asked to uh, develop the lagrangian equation of motion from the hamiltonian equation of motion using legend transformation so i think this is a, a different approach to obtain the lagrangian from hamiltonian next question says let g of k is the fourier transform of f of x so that that is uh, minus infinity plus infinity f of x square dx equals to minus infinity plus infinity g of k square dk so g of k is the fourier transform of f of x so this is 1 by root 2 pi minus infinity plus infinity f of x e to the power i k x dx and uh, f of x equals to uh, f of x is the fourier transform of g of k is 1 by root 2 pi minus infinity plus infinity g of k e to the power minus i k x dk so if you take the um, f um, that is the left hand side this is nothing but the complex conjugate of this function and the product of this function is like that if you put the uh, uh, f a star x that is the complex conjugate of f of x is 1 by root 2 pi minus infinity plus infinity g star k and this complex conjugate will be e to the power i k x dk and uh, f of x dx so if you rearranging them here this one in the outside and f of x will be like that you can get this is nothing but g of k so this gives you g of k square so finally you will be obtain this expression i think clear next question consider any function f of x is 1 in the range minus a to plus a and 0 elsewhere so this is 1 within this limit and 0 in others other one find the fourier transform function of f of x so g of k equals to f of 
f of x 1 by root 2 pi minus into plus into f of x into the power i k x dx so 1 by root 2 pi minus a 2 plus a otherwise 0 so this will gives you this one. this is 1 so if you integrating this in the, this function and put this value upper limit minus lower limit you can easily find out this is root under 2 by pi sin k by k because this is the sin theta you, the, you, you know the formula of sin theta that is nothing but e to the power i theta minus e to the power minus i theta divided by 2 i this is the expression of sin theta in terms of complex numbers. Next find the Fourier transform e to the power minus mod x you know the definition of basic mod of the mod x you know the basic definition of mod x is like that mod x is equals to x when x greater than 0 and this will be minus x when x less than 0 here you can put the equal to sim sign so this is the basic definition of mod x so if you change this limit minus infinity plus into break into minus infinity to 0 and 0 to infinity for that one this mod x is minus x and for that one this mod x is x after <coughs> putting this uh, one and if you integrating this exponential function and put this uh, value that is the upper limit minus lower limit you know this is 0 and this is 1 so you will obtain easily this one so i think clear about the solution of this question if there is any doubt you must comment in the comment box this is all about me this is my contact details and this is my youtube channel so take care thank you we'll meet in the next video as soon as possible thank you